unraveled the first of what would eventually be 24 civil lawsuits accusing Watson of sexual misconduct during massage therapy sessions. Two days later, the NFL opened an investigation into the matter, and by April, Houston police were also investigating. Then on March 11th of this year, a Harris County grand jury declined to indict Watson on any criminal charges. Watson was then traded to the Cleveland Browns on March 18th. Then, June 21st, Watson's attorney announced settlements for 20 of the lawsuits. That brings us to today, when Watson's legal team announced settlements for three of the four remaining lawsuits, and the NFL announced Watson's six-game suspension. Sports director. NFL's disciplinary officer found that Deshaun Watson engaged in sexual assault as defined by the NFL, but the former Texans quarterback will face only a six-game suspension and will not be fined beyond losing game checks. Those will total about $345,000. Former Judge Sue L. Robinson points out that the NFL argued for Watson to be suspended for a full season, but in her ruling, Robinson cited prior suspensions to arrive at the six-game ban for Deshaun Watson. Many fans tonight wonder what's next. The NFL has three days to appeal today's ruling. The statement we received from the league reads in part, in light of her findings, the league is reviewing Judge Robinson's imposition of a six-game suspension and will make a determination on next steps. It is important to note, if the NFL appeals Watson's six-game suspension, NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell or someone he designates will determine the final suspension. That's part of the NFL's collective bargaining agreement. So it's possible that by the end of the week, Watson will face a much harsher punishment. Attorney Tony Busby represents many of the women who sued Watson for various forms of sexual misconduct. Gave us the statement you see here. My role was to advance the cause of my clients in civil court. Nothing more. I've done that. I am extremely proud of these women and our legal team's efforts. The settlements are confidential. Tonight, the next move is up to the NFL.